Hi everyone, I'm Renee McLennan from the town of Bassendine. Lots of exciting things to update you on from our town from April. So there are some fantastic projects going on in the natural areas within our town. So if you live in Eden Hill, you may have noticed a fence going up this week around um, Merry Crescent Reserve, around the wetland area. So this is in preparation for work starting on the My Park, My Place project, which is a, a great project that's in partnership with Greening Australia and Watercorp um, to transform that space, to restore the wetlands and to really green that reserve. So really exciting project and look forward to seeing that um, be completed. Also there's work under, being undertaken at Ashfield Flats for the lookout. So this is in partnership with Ashfield Can and that's going to see the transformation of that underutilised space at the end of Kenny Street into a really beautiful contemplative space for people to be able to sit and enjoy the natural beauty of the Ashfield Flats. Um, and there's also work going on on Harcourt Street to transform the drains there into living streams that will flow into Bindaring Park. So not only will this beautify the area, but also help with water quality um, flowing into that wetland. This month we've also seen progress on our town centre master planning process. So a big thanks to everyone who's contributed to not only um, the initial focus groups, but more recently the design workshops. It's been fantastic to see people interested and involved about in shaping the future of our town centre. So the next stage from here is that creating communities that will take all of that most recent feedback, incorporate that into the draft plans and come up now with a single draft master plan for our town centre. When this is made publicly available soon, we'd love um, as many people as possible to have a look and give us your feedback so that we can refine it and shape it into a plan that's going to deliver a, a really fantastic town centre for our community um, into the future. Now one of the things Council's been working on behind the scenes of, over recent months is the development of our budget for the next financial year, so 21-22 financial year. Um, part of this process is setting the rates for, for the next year. One of the things that Council is considering um, for the coming year is the, the introduction of differential rates. And essentially that's um, applying a different rating um, amount for different types of properties. So in the town, what we're looking at is potentially introducing a differential rate for vacant land within the town. So the idea behind this would be to encourage development of those vacant properties. We know that our community wants town centre vibrancy. We also know that the state government has requirements for our town around um, the number of new dwellings um, that are built within our community. And so this is just one way that we can encourage development um, within our town. But we'd love to know what you think. Um, jump onto the town's website when the consultation becomes available and let us know your thoughts so that we can ensure that um, the strategy that we adopt reflects um, our community's preferences. Um, on the agenda this month, we also had uh, a draft new local law relating to responsible cat ownership. So there's a couple of um, aspects of the law which are proposed to be introduced which are new. And one of these is cat prohibited areas. So we're really fortunate here in the town of Bassanine to have lots of really beautiful natural spaces and to still have native wildlife in our town. But domestic cats pose a, a threat to that native wildlife. And so we're proposing to have areas um, within the town where there is um, ecological value. So particularly our reserves along the river and then places like Bindaring Park to be cat prohibited areas where domestic cats would not be allowed to enter. Um, there's also a proposal to make um, an offence for cats to be in any place that's not pub to be in any place that's not public. So this would just give our rangers um, more tools available to them if there are cats entering private property and causing problems there. So again, we'd really love to have your feedback um, to help shape that local law and make sure that it does reflect um, what our community values. We also had on the agenda the Old Perth Road markets. So many of you would be aware that we've been going through a, um, an expression of interest process for um, organisations who would be interested in taking over the management of the markets. Um, and I'm pleased to announce that we had a successful applicant and that was Chaos Theory Events. So really pleased that the markets will be continuing in the town of Bassendine under Chaos Theory's events management um, and look forward to there being continued support from our community for that, that great event to bring our community together.